very important, the response time, and the response from both universities was very, very quick. It started straight away with who would be a good fit institution academically, as opposed to just a brand name that they might already know. Uh, but the agent was essential in that, as they were with the visa process. But also how important it was to be able to link with potential other students who are going to be joining you while you were doing your studies, so you begin to make friends before you even come and study. How students located their pre-arrival information, so maybe we expected them to find it in the emails or information that we sent to them, but our students said that they searched out things themselves online or looked for other students, so they were getting the information kind of informally as well as formally how we would provide it to them. Shahla, I think the biggest shock for her was the fact that um, she didn't know that her children would be learning Welsh as well as English, so um, clearly some more information there could have been um, nice. And the other thing that universities should be aware of is of the reverse culture shock, so students going back to their own countries, because that's something that will affect all the international students when they go back. I would say it's very difficult for international students uh, to stay in UK to work because of the visa problem. I'd like to thank all our students again. I'd like to thank you all for coming, and I hope that you feel like you got a lot out of it. And I think one key lesson we've all learned is that we should listen to our students more. Thanks. <laughs>